to the markets analyst, Mr. Kelkar, who is here with us on the show now. You know, it looks like the markets are somewhere taking a pause after the correction that we saw coming in. There's just so many factors that are impacting, impacting the stock prices, especially the benchmark indices of the country, whether it is the expectation of a rate hike by the Fed on the back of the FOMC meet, which is coming in in December. You've got a likely base, uh, basis points rate cut happening in India as well with the monetary policy that is just going to be coming out. And of course, you've got that Italian referendum as well, which is playing a bit of uh, a stalemate on the European indices as well, giving a negative cue to the Indian markets as well. Give us an entire macro sense of how the markets you would like to see in the near term and how do you see the markets in the long term as well reacting and whether any kind of change is likely to happen on the back of these three very important cues that the Nifty and the Sensex are picking up at this point of time. Okay. Uh, if we talk about uh, near term market movement, I am expecting a high volatility in the next two weeks because there are uh, various uh, events which are lined up. The next week we have a Fed Reserve meeting which would announce the rate hike in US markets and uh, European countries meeting also in the uh, next week, uh, sorry tomorrow. So uh, I am expecting a volatile sessions in the next two weeks. But if we talk about long term movement of the uh, indices, I am strongly bullish on Indian markets. Uh, for the next three to four years, my view would remain bullish till the time I see a bottom of Nifty, of uh, bottom which was made in the last three months, which was around 7,600. Till the time we are above the 7,600 levels, I am uh, very bullish on the stock markets and I can see Nifty testing uh, around 10,000 marks in the next two to two and a half years.